and I've teamed together with Perico to take my pelvic floor from LBL to ironclad by undertaking the four weeks to an ironclad for JJ challenge. All I'm gonna do for this challenge is the Pericoach device, which is so small you can take it with you anywhere you go if you're going away, then the smartphone or tablet, my smartphone comes with me everywhere, and my vagina. I don't need to say it, right? <laughs> Obviously. Um, look, <laughs> there's my other pussy. My problem areas, or wet spots, as we call them in the industry, so I don't, I just made that up. Uh, around um, this and this. <coughs> so hopefully, after I do a whole lot of this, we'll be able to see exactly what progress the Pericoach app maps over the four weeks. I've already calibrated the device and the smartphone to my own personal vajut strength. So, let's get our frunch on. Uh, one week in, I had a notification telling me that I needed to recalibrate because my resting um, uh, tension was higher than my initial clenching tension from when I first calibrated. So, uh, so it's working. Faces are optional. I skipped the gym today because I've got a cold and I don't feel very well, but I'm not skipping this because oh, I'm committed. So I blitzed the beginner phase and then I moved on to intermediate and I failed. I had no squeeze, I couldn't do anything, I failed every single round. And I remembered all I need to do is recalibrate the machine. I tell it what my maximum is. <laughs> To be honest, it's not even like I really have a burning desire to jump on a trampoline. It's just that I'd like the option. Ooh. I discovered a rather pleasant little side effect which I didn't read about on the Pericoach website and that is I have greater sexual function. It has been noted by my partner but also I can tell I've got more crunch in my French and that crunch is, uh, is giving me greater control over um, I definitely have increased pelvic floor strength according to the Perry Coach app. That said, I can't jump on a trampoline. Uh, I, can, I can skip much better and I can run just fine, but trampoline is my kryptonite. Realistically though, my pelvic floor has been shabby for five years. So expecting to be ironclad in four weeks was probably a little bit optimistic. Um, I think that consistency is going to be the key and continuing to build on what I've already started is going to be the way to, uh, to get there in the end. Uh, I reckon having improved sexual function is kind of much cooler than jumping on a trampoline anyway. So the ironclad for JJ challenge is not a wash. I may not be ironclad in four weeks, but I am definitely on my way. Thanks for watching. See ya. Hey.